Okay, Ollie, here we go. Three seconds. <clears throat> Okay, so hopefully this is working and we are now live uh, for all of you guys around the world watching, uh, joining uh, me for a workout down with the Royal Marines this afternoon. Um, so here we go, look, text in, thumbs up, that is good. Hold on, hold on. Okay, good, so, um, so yeah, that's working, awesome. Um, so I'm down at the moment with the Royal Marines at 4-2 Commando in Plymouth in the UK, which is one of the commando units of the Royal Marines. Uh, they are doing an incredible job uh, supporting a lot of the civilian teams that are out doing the COVID testing at the moment. So we've been to visit some of them today. But obviously when the troops come back, back to their commando barracks, a core cool part of their life is obviously staying fit. Uh, and in their case, staying fighting fit. So we're gonna do a workout this afternoon. We're gonna do one of our BMF, one of our B military fit workouts. We got Captain Ollie Mason here, who's a Royal Marines officer with, with 4-2 Commando. Uh, he's gonna join me. We're social distancing at two meters. We're outside and we're doing one of our P BMF sessions. Uh, at B military fit though, we are really proud to be the biggest outdoor fitness company now in Europe. And, you know, obviously lockdown has been really tough because we've had to go inside, but we've adapted. We've brought a lot of our workouts online and inside. This week, though, for the first time, we're allowed to exercise properly outside again. So this is good news. The sun is shining. Uh, well done to all you Royal Marines uh, who've been working hard today doing the COVID testing. Huge respect to you. Uh, I know today we've got Royal Marines joining this session from all over the world, from Diego Garcia, uh, to Faz Lane in Scotland, all over the place. So welcome. Uh, this is going to be 30 minutes. It's going to be a body weight session. You can do this wherever you like. Uh, but Ollie, thanks so much for joining us today. Tell us why, why is fitness so important to Royal Marines? There's two reasons for this there. <clears throat> Firstly, for operations, um, you carry lots of weight uh, over long distances um, <clears throat> for days and days at a time. So it's really important yeah. that we build up our our capacity, our ability to work for days and days at a time, but also work and operate when we're tired. Uh, when, we, you know, when we haven't had a protein shake and loads of sleep, but our ability to be able to pick up our kit, exhausted and go forward. I might have to speak pretty loudly for <clears throat> this one as well. And, second, and secondly, it's really important, as the world knows now, and it's, as it's Mental Health Awareness Week, it's very important for our mental health and to keep our mind sharp. And you need a, a sharp mind when you deploy on operations and when you deploy on exercise so you make clear decisions. And what is 4-2 Commando's normal role? 4-2's normal role, they are responsible for global maritime operation in the deepest, darkest parts of the planet, um, doing some really, really interesting stuff. That's as much as you're going to get him out of the sneaky beaky 4-2 commando role. But they are maritime specialists and they are always good fun to be around and highly professional. So there we go. Okay, so we're going to get ready for this workout. Um, we are going to, all you need is a good attitude for this. You don't need any kettlebells. You don't need pull-up bars or anything, just body weight. We're going to do it in three eight minute blocks okay and in between each eight minute block we're going to take a couple of minutes to rest recover answer a few questions speak to ollie and then back into the next slot each of those eight minute slots we can hear you both great that's good and messy um each of these eight minute blocks we're going to do as 40 seconds of work 20 seconds of rest times eight okay 40 seconds work 20 seconds rest four two four two commando 40 seconds work come on 20 seconds rest times eight and then we're going to rest. We're going to do that three times. I've got a clock ready to go. We're going to start just by warming up a little bit. So if we all get in position. Okay, we start just with the hips round. Here we go. Get them moving. And the other way. And we're going to start jogging. And we're going to bring the knees up a little bit higher. And then we're going to bring the knees up a little bit higher and just jogging. And then we're going to get the arms going. And 
forward. And the neck around. Other way. Wow, it's hot here. It's going to be a hot workout already. Okay, stretching all the way back. And then all the way forward. Hanging down there low. We're going to be getting a lot of legs into this one. And then all the way back a little bit further. Stretch it out. And forward. And jogging on the spot. Okay, we keep it moving. Okay, we're about to start our first eight minute block. Are you ready for this? You're gonna hear the clock going. 40 seconds work, 20 seconds rest. Times eight, and then we'll have a, have a stop. Okay, and I'll tell you each exercise as we are doing it. The first is gonna be starting with a plank. So, Warm up. Zero of eight. you should be able to hear this. Okay, we're about to start into plank position. Here we go, knee to elbow. Alternate, knee to elbow, here we go. 40 seconds of this, great core workout. Doing all it good, good. Okay, and rest. Twenty seconds rest. Next one's going to be an ice skater, which is going to be like this. So we go across, touch, across, touch. That's going to be forty seconds of that. Okay, starting in five seconds. You ready? Here we go. Helicopter inbound, <laughs> dropping off some Marines. Medic! <laughs> Keep going, five seconds. Okay, shake it out. 20 second rest. Next one's gonna be in plank position again, down to the hands, up to the elbow, okay? <sighs> Breathe it in. Are you ready? Plank position, and down to the hands, up to the elbow. Keep it going, team. Five seconds. Yes. And rest. Next one's gonna be squat jumps. Whew. Jumping up, try and get off the ground if you can with the jumps. 10 seconds rest. Only got, done three. We've got five more to go, here we go. These are gonna be squat jumps, 40 seconds, ready? There you go. Oh, these are hard. Five seconds. Yes. Good job, breathe it in, 20 second rest. We're going as press ups next. We're getting there team. We're halfway through this first batch of eight. 
Everyone hanging on in there? Look, we've got lots of people joining us, great. And we've got some Marines from the US, Marine Corps as well. Welcome yeah. to you guys. Press up position. Okay, press up, here we go. Five seconds. Yes. Rest, breathe it in. Sit ups, bicycles, knee to alternate elbow on your back. Clear the ground, get yourself ready. 10 seconds. You should be getting hard. Here we go, full crunch it in. Boom, here we go. Oh, on that. We're getting there. Okay, the next one is a press up, but your bum is high. So instead of being flat, your bum's high and your shoulders are going down. Okay, so you're doing like that, but in press up position. Shoulders, five seconds. Here we go. So they look like this. Great legs, bum in the air, full head to the ground. Bring those feet in, thumb high, keep it moving. The shoulder exercise. Yeah. Yes. And rest. One more of this first round of eight. Sit ups, but with straight legs, straight arms, touch your toes and wide, like a clam, okay? On your back, touch your toes, open up. Here we go. Eight of eight. <laughs> Five seconds. Okay, we have two minute rest. Who's starting to sweat? I am. Captain Mason, how are you doing? Good, nice and warm. <laughs> okay, we're gonna reset the clock. Ready for the next eight minutes. Can you hear the, um, can you guys hear the beeps okay always? Give me a thumbs up for that. I love it, that's good. So, uh, Ollie, tell us, how hard is it to become a Royal Marine? What's training really like? How long is it? How hard is it? Firstly, Royal Marine's training Make sure is, very, is very hard. It's very long. It's 32 weeks for a recruit. It's 15 months to be an officer. However, Royal Marines do not expect Royal Marines on day one. The entry test is very, very modest. It's upstairs what counts. You get the fittest guys in the world arrive on day one who go by the wayside. It's the most determined and the most committed. More often than not, the guys that weren't the strongest at the beginning 
they've got the determination and resolve to power on through and finally get a green beret. And everybody's going to have weeks where they just don't feel like going on. What would you say, having seen people go through training so much, is a key skill? If you had to give a recruit day one one tip, what would it be? Make, make friends, because in those dark times, it's your oppo, your friend, your buddy, that's going to pick you up and say, come on, mate, let's get going, because guaranteed in a week's time, he's going to be low and he's going to need you yeah. to carry him through. Yeah, there you go. It's great advice. Friendship's first day. Okay, are we ready for the next batch of eight exercises? Okay, Ollie, you're leading this one. You've got burpees with a press up, plank, ski jumps, plank, repeat. So we're going to set the clock. Are you ready? First exercise, Ollie, what was it? Burpees first, all the way down, chest to the floor. Here we go. So burpees with a press up. Oh, this is going Five seconds. Yes. Good oh. Blow. Good blow. oh my god. Burpees kill it. Next up, I think you said plank. Yeah. On the elbows. Plank on Flat the elbow. Back. Flat back, you heard him. Five seconds. This should be getting hard. Here you go. Why is the core why is core so important for Royal Marine? So many people in fitness get confused, you know, think that it's all legs and biceps. However, in the military, you have to carry lots of kit. That goes on your back, and the main muscle that looks after you then, sorry, the main muscle group, is your core. When you do things like rope climbing, anything at high rope which involves kicking your legs up, you can have the biggest biceps in the world, but if your core isn't strong, you aren't getting up. There you go. Five seconds. Yes. Okay. What's next, Ollie? Ski jumps. Ski jumps, a little demo. Here we go. <laughs> and as you know, all Royal Marines are great skiers, so they spend so much time in Norway in the Arctic. This is the muscles they need for that. Here we go. Oh, these are getting hard now. 15 seconds, team. Ah. Yes. And back to planks. If you're not feeling this, you're an animal, to make it harder, stretch the workout time, reduce the rest time. Some people could be doing 55 seconds of this, five seconds rest. We're lucky, we're at 4-2 Commando, we're on 40-20, here we go. Plank position. You wanna do high plank, like this, or low plank like Ollie. So how long, how long have you been in the Marines, Ollie? Been in for 14 years. And it's changed my life for the better. In what been, way? Been to some places that you could only dream of going to the deepest, darkest jungle, to the desert. You know, some people would pay millions to go to these places. And in the Marines, you get paid to go. <laughs> it's amazing. <laughs> Two tours of Afghanistan. Yes. I'm sure a lot of people would be pay paying for that. But you never know. Two tours of service, good for you. And so many. 
Marines on camp at the moment who've given so much of their life and dedication, taken so much risk for all of us. This building you can see here, this is the back of the mess. It looks rough. It's got lots of heart. Here we go. Let's Burpees go. team. <laughs> Oh, these are getting hard. Five seconds. Yes. Oh. Planks. We work, team. Keep it going. Almost there through the second round of eight. We had a lot of other Romerians wanting to join this, but we're limited to two people in lockdown with two meters between us. So, Captain Mason drew the short straw of having to work out. But the great thing about, you know, the internet is through this YouTube channel, we can reach thousands and thousands of people and we can all train together. And that's what BMF is about as well. Be Military Fit, veteran run business, helping veterans. It's now free if you're a veteran, you trade for free. And in the UK, if you're a health worker for the NHS, you also train for free. And we're so proud of that. Yes. Oh. Almost there, guys. Last minute what before we you on? get a rest. Ski jumps. Oh. 10 second rest. So yeah, check out bmilitaryfit.com, sign up, join us for a, a session. Seven of eight. Here we go, ski jumps. Give us some thumbs up if you're a skier watching this. Oh yes, I know a few skiers who are training with us now. Craig, if you're watching this. Craig Murray, New Zealand. Might be 3 a.m. But as every Marine knows, night is their friend. I hope you're up with us. <laughs> Craig, brilliant skier, one of the best in the world. Strong legs, he could do this one all day. Oh my God, 10 seconds. Five seconds. Oh. Hard. And a plank to finish this, this round. And then I'm gonna be talking for two minutes but key qualities for a lockdown. <laughs> Stick with us. Dan Etheridge, our cameraman on so many shows. I know you're training with us now. Come on, Danny boy. You're the fittest person I know. Unbelievably tough. Got so many rude things I could say about Dan, but but not said online. It's a family show there. <laughs> it's a family show. Legend of a man, Danny Etheridge. Check him out on Instagram. Yeah, Danny Etheridge. And Pete Lee, always a shout out for you. Who else we got training? Here we go, five seconds. Okay, we got a two minute break now before Probably the toughest eight minutes. Another helicopter coming in. It's what happens if you work out on a commando base. You get a lot of helicopters flying in and landing. Dropping Marines off, taking Marines off on exercise, all sorts of things. It's, uh might always look a bit rough, these barracks, but their places are great camaraderie and great friendships and a lot of laughs as well. Uh, okay, questions from you guys. Here you go, I've got one here. Key qualities for surviving in lockdown. Well, listen, first of all, it's Mental Health Awareness Week. And there's no doubt lockdown has been mega tough for many, many people all over the world. You know, we're so used to that connection with other people, freedom of movement. Maybe we'll never take those things for granted and maybe that would be a great thing to come out of this. The value of touch and connection with people we love. Um, but 
I was thinking about this. The key qualities for me for surviving lockdown are the same qualities that they teach to young commandos when they first arrive at Commando Training Centre Limpston. And those are the commando values, four of them. Number one, courage. You know, and that's not bravado. Courage is quiet courage to be able to walk towards the things you fear, humbly, quietly, but always moving forward. Secondly, determination above all. You know, never give up that resilience, that never say die attitude to keep going. Thirdly, unselfishness. If you're in lockdown with people or you're in a troop of, of Royal Marines together, one of the key, key things is unselfishness. Being kind, being kind, king. And lastly, uh, cheerfulness in adversity, which means being positive when it's difficult. And again, for those of us in lockdown, always try and choose an attitude, a positive attitude, to be enthusiastic, cheerfulness in adversity. Four commander qualities, four things to help us all during difficult times. Are you ready for the last round of eight? Here we go. These are gonna be hard, I'm gonna warn you. We've got high knees, we've got Russian twists, we've got whole lot. We're going to start with high knees. Yeah, okay. Zero Don't quit on me now. Keep going. Come on, you BMFers. Tens of thousands of you out there. Train, keep training. We encourage each other. High knees, I like this. Here we go. Imagine you're climbing a rope as well. Your knees up, grabbing for that rope. It's a core exercise and it's a hard <coughs> lung exercise. Keep good stability, good balance. We're gonna have some balance exercises in this last eight. Keep going. Five seconds. And rest, 10 seconds, 20 seconds. We're going to do a press up, but after each press up, we're going to open up wide. Press up, open up wide. Okay, you surviving? How are you, Captain? Always smiling. <laughs> press up position. Here we go. Down and open up. Down and open up. Good core strength. Nice smooth movement. <coughs> If these are too hard, you can do them from your knees. These ex all of these exercises you could do with a weighted vest to make it harder, or a little backpack with some weight in it. You can up the time, reduce the weight. You can always adapt. Should be hard. And we're resting. Only six exercises to go. Russian twists next. They look like this, feet up, your core up, touching the elbow down, legs stay off the ground. Wish you guys got it. Ready? Here you go. Nice controlled exercise. Good balance. Your feet always stay off the ground. Tight core. Touch the elbow down. Don't lean on it. Just touch it down and off. Keep those feet off the ground. If it's too hard, you put the feet on the ground. Try and keep them up. Ah. Mountain climbers. Okay, nice steady pace. Pace yourself with these. Press up position, bring your legs back and forward. You ready? We're getting it. Come on, Royals. Come on, you BMFers. Come on, you people all over the world. United in endeavor. Here we go. Okay. Here we go. See it clearly. Keep the knees moving, tight core. Good balance, good shoulder stability. Oh, is it getting hard? 15 seconds, come on. Digging deep. Yes. 
Five seconds. Oh. We are getting so close, guys. Dorsal raises. You know that lying on your tummy. Lift your back up. Lift your back, not your head. Okay, going on to our stomach. Like this. Lifting up. That's too easy. Put your arms further away. If it's too hard, bring your arms closer in. Yeah. Yeah. Uh. Five seconds. Uh. Oh my God. I want the hands and knees now. Narrow press ups. Like this. These are too hard, do them on your knees. If they're semi too hard, switch between on your knees and on your feet. Narrow press ups, are you ready? Six of eight. Okay, here we go. Whoa. These are hard. Yeah. How are you doing, Ollie? Oh, it's starting to get really hard now. We're in the hurt locker. Ah. Oh, breath of fresh air, feel that. Oh, wow. Ten seconds. Yes. Oh, that's good. We're going to like these next exercises. One leg squats. Oh my word. Okay, small movements. This is about balance and strength in the instability. So lift one leg up, Seven just feet. little movement. It's about balance, a so small movement to start with. As you get better, you start to go deeper. But let's just start small. Balance, this is going to get really hard. Face yourself. Right, keep that foot up if you can. Want to do a deeper one? Five seconds. Take it out. Wow. Those are hard, but they are great exercises. Balance, core, focus. It's as much about the mind as it is the body. Here we go. One leg up. Want a deeper one? Here we go, keep going. 15 seconds, easy. That's all we got left. Yeah. Ah. Five seconds. Keep going to the end. Oh. Jogging on the spot. It's our warm down. Okay, breathing it in and back. Breathe it in. And reach you forward, all the way. Hanging down, suck it in. And back again. Back. The reward at the end of this workout is that we get three bars from the Rocky soundtrack. It's coming, 10 seconds. It's our reward for 30 seconds of work. It's coming, it's gonna be worth it, you ready? Come on, here we go. Well done, shake it out. Reaching really tall on your toes. And shake it out. Oh, great job, guys. Great, great job. Whew, how's that?
tough. A lot of good sweat going on. But really good way to end the day. Very good. It's been an amazing day. And again, final shout out to all of you Royal Marines and all of you Marines from all around the world, part of the Marine family, our USMC brothers and Marines in many nations. Uh, you're all amazing. Thank you for your service. And what I love is that the Royal Marines have had to adapt. Where are they today? They're not diving through the windows dressed in black. They're helping test for COVID-19, supporting the civilian services. So well done to all you Royal Marines. Well done to all of you who did the BMF workout today. Remember, if you are a veteran, you train with us for free. And if you're a key worker with the NHS, a nurse, or any of the others within the <coughs> NHS, you also can train with us at this time for free. And we're really proud of that. And we've got BMF trainers, hundreds of them, uh, on this call at the moment. But just say, you guys should be also really proud of everything you represent, helping so many people. So spread the word to veterans and to nurses. Come and train with us for free. We want to support you having positive, good physical health and physical fitness, because that helps us all round. Uh, Ollie, final question for you. What would you say, looking back on all your service, the Royal Marines has given you? Oh, I mean, how, how long have you got? Really? <laughs> um, first, it's given me the opportunity to raise an amazing family. And I don't think there are many organisations out there that can give you the benefits and family support that the military do. It's given me the opportunity to actually travel. I've made some of the best friends in the world. I've been well paid. I've been well looked after. If ever I've had a drama, the services have been there to support me. Um, so if anyone is in any doubt whether they should join the Royal Marines, there's only one answer, and that's go onto the website, search Royal Marines, and start your new life journey now. So yeah, amazing. Uh, if you're young and you're after adventure and you're into fitness and the outdoors and friendships, check out Royal Marines. And if you're just somebody who loves the outdoors and loves fitness and loves community, check us out at bemilitaryfit.com as well. Uh, we're here to support you in your fitness goals, build that community. I just want to say thank you for sharing uh, this time with us. Hope you enjoyed it. 30 minutes BMF workout. Come on, we did it. We can't do a high five because we're social distancing, but we never give up. Take care, guys. Ollie, legend. Thank you so much, my friend. You're amazing.